The Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC, has stated that it will be unfair to evaluate it based on the upload error that occurred during the presidential election on February 25th, and it does not represent all polls. Festus Okoye, the National Commissioner for INEC, made this comment in reaction to the final report on the general elections of 2023 that the European Union Election Observation Mission presented on Monday. Okoye claimed that despite the difficulties encountered, many Nigerians applauded the electoral authority for using the bimodal voter accreditation system during the general elections. As far as we are concerned, we are going to present our report, our, our, uh, we, are, we are going to make our submissions to the court, we are going to present what we know and what we did during the elections to the presidential election petition tribunal and all the other election petition tribunals. And then they will make a determination on, uh, uh, going forward. But as far as the commission is concerned, there were so many positives to this election. There were also significant challenges and problems with the election. We are going to address those, those uh, uh, challenges and those, and those problems. And if, there are, if we receive most of the reports from the domestic and international observers, we will harmonize them, take out the actionable ones that have administrative level, we will implement them. If there are still challenges with the Electoral Act 2022 20, um, and the constitutional framework, we will also join Nigerians and go before the National Assembly to get both the constitutional and legal framework uh, amended. But let me say this, that as Nigerians, we must have faith in our democratic institutions, we must have faith in our democracy, and we must continue to work on our democracy because the electoral process and democracy uh, 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 we keep on improving. It's, it, there is no country in the world that can say it has a perfect democracy. No. You have to grow it, you have to nurture it, and you have to keep on nurturing it. Challenges will emerge, but the robustness of these issues will determine how strong a democracy He added that the law now gives political parties the right to be aware of what occurs at the polling units. Now, but we must also recognize the fact that the law, the law itself, has also given the political parties the opportunity to know what goes on at each polling unit. Almost all the political parties, or the at least five of the political parties, nominated and got accredited over 170,000 polling agents. So what that means is that they had primary evidence of the results from the polling units. And it is those results from the polling units. So and it cannot be correct for a political party to rely only on result upload in order to get the evidence with which he wants to prosecute uh, his case in court. But as I say, we have uh, cases in court, petitions are already in court. Let the court make a determination of whether the commission did well or the commission did not do well. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.